Today I want to talk about an exciting project known as Komodo. So Komodo is one of my favorite coins at the moment and I'm going to be going over some slight fundamentals and then also some technical analysis on why I feel like Komodo is a great buy at the moment. So Komodo um, is a privacy coin and it's got a lot more than that going for it. So in brief, I feel Komodo is almost like a better version of Bitcoin. It's cheaper, faster, private. Then it's actually got a platform. So it's like Ethereum where things can actually be built on top of it. And But it's decentralized ICOs rather than um, normal ICOs like Ethereum has. So potentially this type of platform could be extremely popular moving forward. Then it's actually got its own exchange that it's coming out with, and that's called Bartadex Exchange. Now, Bartadex is also a decentralized exchange, and I think that in a year or two, decentralized exchanges are going to be much more popular than, for example, a Binance or a Bittrex exchange, which is a centralized exchange, and you don't actually own your keys, uh, your private keys or your coins. The exchange holds them. So this is why... This is a great thing that Komodo has going for it. Now, let's talk uh, Litecoin. So Litecoin, everyone's cheering Litecoin. I think Litecoin's a fantastic coin. But everyone's loving them because they can do atomic swaps. Now, I don't know exactly how many atomic swaps they've done, but it's definitely not this many. Um, Komodo's done so many more atomic swaps. And I think they were the first ones, actually. So... Komodo's fundamentals are set up to launch it uh, huge moving forward. It just needs a bit more hype and a little bit more marketing behind it. And if we start to see the emotions of people getting behind Komodo, there's no reason why it couldn't really, really launch. Um, there's also a new website coming. So Komodo's got a lot of things going for it. Now let's look at the chart here. So this is compared to dollars. I like to do dollars and Bitcoin just to see if there's any anything going for it. So, you know, we've got two support and resistance lines. We've got a full market cycle. We've got a big pump up and then all the way down, all the way down. And this is in dollar values. Now, we're unsure where it's going to go. It looks like it's found support right here at about $3.70 or something like that. Now... My prediction is it finds support. It may drop down a little bit more, but once it finds some real support, we're heading up. And I reckon we're heading up quite high um, for its next pump up. I love Komodo. I love the fundamentals. And then what I'm seeing here is just a great time to buy. You know, it's, it's around, uh, what, $3.80. Could drop down a little bit. You never know. It might come down, touch, and bounce back up. But I think we're sort of bottoming out here, which is interesting. But compared to Bitcoin, potentially shows a different story. Uh, so here we've got, you know, we've got similar sort of pump up, pump up, pump up. Uh, so we're looking for another pump up. And once again, we've got two support and resistance lines here in yellow that we're looking at. And we're looking to really pump through this resistant line. So hopefully we find resistance here. So I'm feeling like Komodo really needs to hold here rather than break down. And if we can hold here and find support, then we're looking to really break out uh, yeah, so one more thing about Komodo that I didn't show you is the moving averages. So, yeah, it's still being squashed by the 149 here. So there's still downward pressure. That's why we're looking for it to really hold as much as possible. Have that 149 come down, cross the 66, and once it crosses, that's the time that we're like, okay, we're heading in. Uh, so that's what we're looking for. And we're also looking for some volume to come in as well. So maybe right now isn't the best time for buying Komodo. But I think it's a 
great coin moving forward and it's one that I actually do hold a decent amount of myself and I think you know within a week or two this could be a massive massive buy but just wanted to put put it on your radar and uh, see what you feel so that's all from me today Komodo on the radar and uh, looking for a big a big head on up